Former New York Governor Elliot Spitzer may be in big trouble again. Now he's under investigation for an alleged assault at the Plaza Hotel. The Monday morning headlines scream out, Spitzer choked me and Plaza attack. Stephen Fabian is outside the iconic hotel in Midtown. The first sign of trouble came in a 911 call on Saturday night from a 25 year old woman. Cops rushed to the 15th floor where they found the former governor who reportedly told them everything's fine. There's no problem. Cops left, but they returned several minutes later and entered the suite after noticing blood and broken glass. The woman was identified as Russian born Svetlana Travis. She reportedly told police that Spitzer choked her and she is said to have cut her wrists after the alleged attack. She was rushed to Mount Sinai Hospital. The incident took place in room 1541 in one of the hotel's Edwardian suites. It features Louis XV style furnishings, gold bathroom fixtures, and butler services. Spitzer has not been charged. His spokeswoman would only say there is no truth to the allegation. We've learned that Svetlana has attended film classes at NYU. Her relationship with Spitzer is not known. There are reports she has flown back to Russia. Spitzer resigned in disgrace in 2008 after the bombshell revelation that he was client number nine, his code name for a high-priced call girl ring. 22-year-old Ashley Dupree became famous as the former hooker who charged Spitzer more than $4,000 a night. Spitzer split from his wife of 26 years, Silda, who stood by his side when he resigned in disgrace, a moment in political history that inspired the TV show The Good Wife. Spitzer has most recently been linked to public relations executive Liz Smith, who once served as Mayor de Blasio's spokeswoman. They broke up last Christmas.